Hello everyone, this is video number two on the clogs dance. We're going to continue where we left off. Uh, it's going to be for both violins, you play the same thing. And it's going to be from measure 11 until measure 19. I'll play through once and then uh, we're going to explain it. So. <laughs> Actually, the main theme of our clogs dance, what we did in the previous video, is more of an introduction, not the actual theme. So it's pretty important part. Uh, we're gonna take first the first two uh, measures. We're starting off in mezzo forte with half notes, continued by eight notes. Um, the main thing that I would like you to do is um, play them with long bow and very connected. So. <laughs> those actually four bars um, of course you won't be using a lot of bar on the eight notes but for the quarter notes and um, half notes as much bow as we can with no separation whatsoever uh, one more time so one, two, from 19 and 20 it's similar with our beginning here we need to come back to frog short and um, more separated that's our contrast both violins and then from measure uh, 20 to measure 23 this is just for the first violins it's a plain and simple D scale in quarter notes where uh, we're gonna uh, use the same um, style of connecting our strokes and longer bows. Here's your share of your scale practice. So that's it for the clock dance. Uh, it's a very short passage, but I would like you to uh, look over it and learn it uh, for this week. Okay, happy practicing again. Bye-bye.